David Yonkai from the LULAC Political Letter is here today. We're talking about a big event tonight in Scranton honoring former mayor Jim McNulty. David, thanks for being here. Very happy to be here to talk about this. So an exciting night, uh, Jim McNulty's 70th birthday. There's a charitable angle to the, the night as well, which we'll talk about in a moment. But let's go back in time here to the early to mid-80s. Talk about uh, McNulty's career as mayor. Well, his career as mayor, I think, was... A very stellar in the sense that he w he actually planted the seeds for the redevelopment of the city of Scranton. Before he became mayor, there was no steam town. He helped get the people from Bellows Falls, Vermont, to bring the train station into the area. And also the Radisson, where the event is going to be held tonight, that used to be an old rundown railroad station. My dad used to be a railroader, and I'd go up there and see it. And Jim McNulty was responsible in his administration for re developing that hotel which is right into the entrance of the city of town so he did a great deal to actually plant the seeds for what today is what we what we call the modern Scranton obviously yeah, making a lot of uh, positive changes that we've seen develop over the past 30 years or so now the event tonight uh, it's Jim's 70th birthday so explain a little bit about the birthday bash and the uh, kind of the charitable end to it as well well Jim McNulty right now is battling stage 4 colon cancer cancer and as a cancer survivor myself now I understand and other people understand that you need a lot of friends and support around you and so the event today is going to be a 70th birthday for him and the admission is just going to be a happy birthday card with whatever people want to contribute to his cause or else the Cancer Society cause. And if they can't make it out tonight, um, we'll, which we'll get to in a moment, there is a way they can make a donation to the Foundation for Cancer Care. Right, and it was the Foundation for Cancer Care, and th I believe that's up on the screen, correct? Yeah. It is. So yeah. for anybody interested in actually attending the event, you said it was at the Radisson? It's at the Radisson, 6 o'clock tonight. All you need in for an admission is a birthday card to wish the mayor a happy birthday. He is fully confident he'll be around for his 71st, and 72nd, and 73rd. And as far as the mayor goes, um, since, since his days in office, I mean, what do you think are some of the positive changes we've seen in the city of Scranton in, say, the past 30 years? Well, I think you've seen more excitement. I think you've seen Scranton as a destination for people to come. And also the fact that nationally, I don't think the office happened by accident. I think that happened because of the possess of Jim McNulty. Larry Holmes is supposed to be up there tonight. And Jim McNulty, during his administration, actually brought back boxing to Scranton. And he actually brought a championship fight with Larry Holmes. And Larry Holmes is going to be up there tonight, too. That is incredible. What an event tonight, of course, with the charitable angle, helping out the Cancer Foundation. Again, you can send donations to the Foundation for Cancer Care. Um, all you do is address the checks to that. And you can send it to Penn Avenue, second floor in Scranton. And uh, before we leave, David, uh, you always wear a special tie. There's always is a significance behind it. What do you have today? It's a birthday tie. It's the mayor's birthday. And that's why I'm wearing the tie. If anybody would like to come up and spill something on my tie and see the mayor, that's fine. All right. So <laughs> find David at the <laughs> Radisson tonight. And of course, if you want to find out some more about uh, David's blog, how can our viewers do that? It's www.lulacpoliticalletter.blogspot.com. David Yonkai from the Lulac Political Letter. Have a great time tonight at the party. And thank you so much. Thank you for having me here. Thank you.